Now, climate change, we know, has made our lives a lot more difficult. The seas are rising, our summers are hotter, the cyclones are getting bigger. But for Australia, the problem is a bit more immediate. In Australia, they're dealing with animal invasions. Spiders are blanketing fields and roads with their webs, and millions of mice are cutting their way through farms. It may sound like some heavenly reckoning, but these animals are just reacting to the extreme weather. Here's a report. Australia, home of the outback and untamed wilderness. An animal kingdom where humans are mere subjects. Nothing's a surprise down under. It's all about how active your imagination is. Don't believe us? See for yourself. Welcome to the state of Victoria, where the spiders have mounted an invasion. Scientists call it ballooning. Victoria saw some wild weather last week. Dozens of trees were toppled and parts of the state were flooded. Sensing danger, the spiders fled. They took refuge in these fields and road signs. Before long, they were weaving webs all over the place. And this is the result. A countryside blanketed by sleek silvery coils. The spiders are long gone, but their webs remain. Elsewhere, there's another invasion underway. A deluge of mice gnawing and biting their way across eastern Australia. This week, they reached here. The Wellington Correctional Center. Authorities could see the disastrous headlines. Prison break, the mice plague edition. So, they acted fast. Around 200 staff and 420 inmates have been shifted out. And now the cleanup begins. The rodents are hanging from the roof and burrowing into walls. Once they are cleared, the inmates will return. As far as threat assessment goes, the mice are far more dangerous. Millions of them have invaded homes and farms. At night, it's almost like the entire house has come alive. The footboards are squeaking. The attic is bustling and there's certainly something running around under your bed. Not fun at all. The mice plague is almost exclusive to Australia. They come when heavy rains follows a long spell of drought. Locals say this plague is the worst they can remember. And experts predict it could get worse. Australia's seesaw climate is causing these strange events. Unusually long dry spells followed by biblical rains. Hardly surprising that the animals are acting out. The government is using an acute poison to repel the mice, but how many rodents can you kill? And how long before the next wave of rodent road rash? Bureau Report, We On, World is One. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.